Hey guys, Lucy here from By Lucy Designs. Um, I just wanted to do a quick check-in video and just basically tell you what I've been up to for the last sort of couple of months. Um, I know it's been a while, so apologies for that. But hopefully you've bared with me and you are still here um, waiting for my next video, which is great. So if you have, then a big thank you to you. So the reason I haven't been, I haven't done any videos recently is because I have been doing quite a few alterations for my brother's wedding. The first thing I've been doing is I've been taking in a size 40 pair of trousers in by a couple of sizes for my husband because he couldn't get the size he needed of the groomsman trousers because they went into a sale. But that was an experience, so hopefully they won't look too bad in the photos. I have had to take in a waistcoat for my future sister-in-law's brother for his outfit for the wedding. Um, he's her man of honour, so he's wearing a nice um, pink silky waistcoat. So I've taken that in at the sides for him, so hopefully that will be just as nice. And then I have um, taken up her wedding dress, so that was quite stressful. Um, so hopefully, fingers crossed, that that all looks lovely when she's got it on. Um, she's coming around tomorrow, so hopefully, fingers crossed, it'll all be okay. So yeah, I was having to do some rolled hems on my overlocker and um, everything like that, but obviously I can't show you that because it's a secret, so shh. So if my brother's watching, sorry. No spoilers here. <laughs> what else have I been doing? I have been to, I've done my Southport show now. That was interesting. It was a little bit of a slow show. I didn't really sell an awful lot of things, but apparently talking to other vendors, they were saying that it was a slow day compared to how it normally is up there. But you know, you have to go and try these places. You have to go and see new shows, take part in new shows to see whether or not they're any good for what you are selling because obviously until you know what works and which ones don't work then you're never really going to know so hopefully that'll have um, been one of the sort of the slower shows for this year hopefully and hopefully the other three or four that I'm doing this year will be better so yeah i'm taking that as a as a learning opportunity um and we will just move on from there but it was lovely that um my in-laws came and supported me at that they came and uh, bought a few things from the stand so that was really nice to see them so the other thing that i wanted to tell you about was i went to a sewing show a couple of weeks ago now and uh, so I went with my mum because she has asked me to make her a couple of dresses for the summer and she wanted to find some material. So my old sewing tutor said that she could get some cheaper tickets. So that was brilliant. So we went along to that and had a really nice day out actually. So she wants me to make her a couple of uh, shift dresses out of linen. So she bought the linen and so I've just tasked her with pre-washing that so that it gets any shrinkage out of the way. So hopefully that will all be lovely and we can start on that in a few weeks. And uh, obviously with it being my mum, she's I'm not charging her anything for them. But she did buy me this lovely, lovely fabric. So it's a jersey. It's almost like a brushed cotton jersey. Um, and... I don't normally go for animal print, but this was just gorgeous. I absolutely loved it. Um, so I thought I would make myself some nice, cosy, um, either pyjama bottoms or lounge pants from that. Um, so she bought me that as a thank you for a preemptive thank you for doing her dresses so when I've got some time to sew for me um, I shall probably make a video on me making them um, so yeah that was lovely 
the final thing that I've been working on over the last couple of weeks is um, one of my best friends has asked me to commit, well, she's basically commissioned me to make her a Jane Austen dress and floor length jacket. So hopefully that will be another success. I'm really looking forward to that project actually. I bought a couple of patterns, um, so one for the dress and one for the jacket because it's sort of a, a shorter jacket um, and then the back goes all the way down to the floor. So yeah, really looking forward to that. So I've just got to order the fabric for that and do some final measuring um, of her. But she only lives around the corner so that was really convenient. And then hopefully, yeah, I should... Uh, be able to maybe show you that if she'll let me. I'm planning on hopefully doing a make video next time because obviously I know I've done a couple of check-ins recently but it's just because I've been so so manic. I've been really busy at my day job and I've just been exhausted so I've had a couple of days off this week and um, managed to get on top of all of the jobs that I needed to get on top of so hopefully over the next few weeks I'll be able to do a little bit more stuff for me i've got another show coming up this month which is just down the road from me in wellingborough so yeah that's easter weekend so saturday the 20th i believe so if you're around you fancy coming down come and uh come and see us come and support us that'd be really lovely to see you come check out my stock because I am really bad and I haven't put any more on Etsy which I really need to do and my husband's even offered to help me photograph my stock which is the bit that takes the time so I will try and get a few more bits on Etsy this afternoon because I'm now done with my alterations which is why I took a couple of days off so hopefully I will see you all in the next video take care bye